only have a short time to be together like this. Soon we'll be looking back nostalgically on these times. Did something happen? I'm just tired. There's no need for you to worry. Since my father passed away, I've been faced with many difficult problems. My inheritance, the future of Kirijo, and the expectations of everyone involved with both. Most likely, I won't be able to attend college or begin a profession. I will have to find another path. Say, what are your thoughts on marriage? I think marriage happens when two people love each other. <laughs> You're so straightforward. However, I'm a Kirito. I cannot simply make a decision according to my emotions. An agreement between two parties such as marriage must be carefully considered. My parents' marriage was arranged for strategic reasons. But as time passed, they slowly grew to love each other. I don't consider them unfortunate. Love comes in all different forms. Do you disagree? Hmm, that's a tough one. If I could speak with my father one last time, I would ask him. I can't believe the library is closing and we're still here. <sighs> Talking in the library. I'm not setting a very good example as student council president. We should go. Yes, who is it? It's me. Oh. You don't stop by very often, senpai. Is something wrong? No. I just wanted to talk. Aw, are you feeling won't we? Hey, are you teasing me? No! Well, maybe just a little. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what this Nyx is like. Hey, do you think it's inside Tartarus? I have no idea. Oh, by the way, I've made my decision. I want to fight to the end. It's better than doing nothing. That's why you're here, isn't it, Senpai? To talk about our decision? I... I guess it is. <laughs> You're so easy to read. I've made my decision as well. Kirijo is making great strides to turn itself around. After I graduate, I plan to assume leadership of the group and continue where my father left off. I cannot turn back now, even if I wanted to. But what if you die? If I die defeating Nyx, then the Kirijo group will have to continue on without me. But I am confident they would fulfill my wishes. Ryoji said Nyx can't be defeated. But I kind of wonder about that. I don't think our special member can be killed either. I agree. Death dwelled within him, amplifying his abilities. Though he was exceptional to begin with. He's an interesting guy, huh? Yes, he is. You know, if things don't work out, I think I'll still be okay as long as I'm with everyone. Honestly, it doesn't matter whether or not we die. All that matters is that we're proud of how we lived. And I'd be proud if we decided to fight Nyx. Does your decision have anything to do with your father? Hmm, a little. But it's more about me and how I feel. I understand. Senpai, when we were in Kyoto, you asked me to stand by your side. Do you remember? Yes, I remember. We will fight together, Yukari. Together.
for some reason, I'm feeling so nervous, even though it's you. Everyone's in their room, too. I hope no one finds out I snuck in here. If I accidentally scream, everybody will hear me. <sighs> what am I saying? Don't get the wrong idea, okay? I didn't hear anything. You got that right. <laughs> Am I always this crazy? <laughs> oh, yeah. I wanted to give you something. This is for you. You know what it is, right? It's the strap for my cell phone. I got it at the opening ceremony for the Moonlight Bridge. It's been my special keepsake for many years. Ever since my dad brought it for me. I used to talk to the toy figurine attached to it when I was here in my room. <laughs> you must think I'm nuts, huh? But, as I got to know you, I talk to my little friend less and less. That's not the only reason I gave it to you, though. I, I'm only going to say this once, okay? I love you. Whew, I said it. hath finally matured. The innermost power of the lover's arcana hath been set free. We bestow upon thee the ability to create Cybele, the ultimate form of the lover's arcana. Well, when all of this is over, we should go do something fun, don't you think? Hey, don't make any plans for tonight, okay? I want to spend some time together. Just the two of us. I am blushing, aren't I? so easy. You simply purchase a ticket at the window and you can watch a movie? It may sound strange, but I have been eager to experience a film in an actual theater. Even though we sat at the end of the aisle, I didn't feel like my view was compromised in the least. I find it interesting that so much thought is put into the design and construction of a movie theater. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Thanks to you. I've always felt too uncomfortable to come here alone. I don't think I would normally have this type of conversation, but it seems to me that Yukari is the type of girl who wouldn't feel inhibited watching a movie by herself. She's also more suited to ride a motorcycle. Wait, a motorcycle? Yes, I believe you've seen it before. I used to use it when I provided support for the team. However, I didn't purchase it solely for that purpose. With a motorcycle, I can go where I want, when I want, all by myself. It's my modest attempt at rebelling against my restricted life. I had planned to get rid of it after it was damaged, but I decided to have it repaired instead. It may be a bit of an exaggeration to say I cherish it, but I do enjoy riding it when I have time to. Let's go for a ride sometime. Together? Just the two of us? Can you ride a motorcycle? Or do you plan to sit on the back? Either way, it would be a lot of fun. 
Thank you. I feel much better. If you don't have any objections, I'd like to stay here with you for a little while longer. I thought you were going to go visit your mother's grave. Oh, hi, Sonata-san. Is this where you should be? Well, I was planning to. But when I thought about what I was going to say to her, it just didn't feel right. There are things I still need to do before I talk to her again. Yeah, same here. I don't have anything I need to tell Shinji right now. I have my own stuff to deal with. An undefeatable enemy, huh? Gosh, I wonder what it's like. You got me. But it doesn't matter because I've made up my mind. I'm gonna look it straight in the eyes. Straight in the eyes. I like the sound of that. You can count me in too. Let's play in the jungle gym! Spin the seesaw, kick the can, we can play them all! Phew! <sighs> I'm tired. We played enough for you to remember me, right? Don't forget. today. And that said, even though we're far away, we're still family. I think that should go for friends like you and me. Yeah, I think someday you will. I sure will. together? I don't really think that's a good idea. But you must! We're supposed to get married someday. Keep this, okay? I made it just for you. Cause one day we'll be trading vows, right? Thou art I, and I am thou. The bond thou hast nurtured hath finally matured. The innermost power of the hanged man Arcana hath been set free. We bestow upon thee the ability to create Attis, the ultimate form of the hanged man Arcana. Wanna put you in a trap?